Okay, this year we, we took the, on the team real change question mark uh, we because you know inspired by you know what's been happening you know, the whole political tsunami and everybody's talking about change 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 so we wanted to, uh, to kind of engage people in discussion of what is real change you know we want change but what is it the artificial change what actually are the elements that go into real change you know so I know it sounds a bit abstract but it's just something that we wanted to bring to the surface lah, so that people can talk about it uh, we just let's talk about the winners of the Justin Lewis uh, Award this year. Three of them. Uh, one story is called uh, Kayo, and it's about the, the story of uh, how this hundred over cyclists actually took to the streets and cycle cycle for like 16 days from the north and the south to KL to talk about the concerns of the marginalised and the poor. Okay, and then uh, the other one was about. Uh, the, what's happening in Perak, the Perak uh, political wrestling match. And then the third one is about Kampung Mamali. It's a, uh, some, a poet, an artist and a singer-songwriter. They took a trip back to Mamali. It was something that happened like in the 80s, you know, and it was actually a massacre. And they just wanted to go and talk to the survivors and find out for themselves the story. So these three stories have that uh, so-called questioning change. The Mamali one could be like, Okay, this massacre ha happened, uh, you know, in the 80s, and uh, what has changed since then? Have they gotten their so-called justice, you know? And then um, the other one, the para one, is actually really, you know, okay, is this the kind of change we want? <laughs> you know, okay, we got the, you know, political change, but looks what what's happening now? How do you make sense of it? And the third one, uh, Kayo, which is about the riding, it's a, it actually dwells into like. Uh, how ordinary people actually committed themselves to go on this ride to look for change. You know, so in their own ways they do question it but not, you know, directly in your face. Like it's all like inspired by certain incidents. Yeah. Okay, this this year uh, we have a great lineup of films. Uh, twenty three films in total. But apart from that, uh, on Friday we're starting off uh, with a bang with uh, something called a community video forum. So it's a special forum that we just uh, kind of like thought of this year. Uh, it's uh, where we invite like community video, eh, sorry, uh, yeah, community video uh, organizers and uh, filmmakers. So how how is how is different is that um, this is uh, these are a group of people who specifically use the video for organizing uh, the youth or women or a special group, and usually they're marginalized group. So the videos may not look so artsy fatsy. They might. But basically, the, the main thing is um, how it's used as a tool for discussion, how it's a tool for organizing, how it's a tool for expression. So uh, we have uh, people like uh, from Indonesia, uh, they share their experience of organizing and uh, women in Aceh you know, after the tsunami, how video was used as a tool for helping the rebuilding and organizing the women. Then we have um, someone from Bali, like they actually had a community video film fest. That means different, different kampongs make a film and they actually had a festival, mm. you know, it's just like what we have here and it's, you know, kind of more dispersed but over there it was the different, different villages. First they had a workshop, then after that they did their film and then they had a screening. So every week it was in a different kampung. Uh, I'm quite proud to say that the Film Film Fest doesn't attract the usual NGO crowd, you know, the converted crowd. Uh, we attract all kinds, uh, you know, uh, the climate in our country and uh, we talk about human rights has also changed. You know, from before it's like really bad word like that, no? Till now it's becoming something like, hey, I want to know what is human rights actually, you know? So, yeah, and human rights covers such a wide range of issues eh, that actually everybody should be interested in it, from children's rights to women's rights to health. Uh, this year we have something on water, the environment, so, yeah, lah, you know? Everybody should, should be interested in it.